Hey guys, how's it going? My name is Catman Joe and welcome back of course everybody to another brand new video. Today guys we are back at it again with another brand new Minecraft Seed Showcase. And uh, today guys, I'm sure you're probably already the title, we are going to be showcasing some Bedrock Survival Island Seeds which is just awesome guys. Now, I know some people might be thinking that's a typo or I might have messed up or misspelled something which uh, I guess 9 out of 10 of the times I do. But guys, I actually haven't. Today this is genuine, I'm going to be showcasing the top 5 best survival island seeds for i guess bedrock edition now before i go anywhere i want to just begin by saying all these seeds came from my good friend septic spot i'm still getting very 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 i guess accustomed to the kind of new i guess features and i guess how it all works on bedrock edition uh, i'm very 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 new to it but yeah so some of you guys might be curious and this is why i'm just taking a minute at the beginning of the video to explain this but yeah we've now got bedrock edition for the longest time and pretty much for the entirety of this channel i've done just legacy edition version of minecraft videos uh duplication glitches see chill cases everything like that for basically the old versions of minecraft the playstation 4 version xbox 360 playstation 3 nintendo or sorry wii u sorry um, and i believe the xbox one console edition as well and for the longest time you guys have asked me to do ones for the bedrock edition and you guys today i am finally on bedrock which means we can finally start uploading those kind of videos and having them a part of the collection so yeah i hope you guys go to enjoy it welcome back to another brand new video let me know what you guys think of this and uh, yeah guys let's just jump right in at number five and uh, yeah let's try this all thing right out. guys so this amazing Amazing seed you're about to see right here, folks. Honestly, it's just gorgeous. I'm not gonna lie, this is a spicy meat ball, if you ask me. Now, I'm not gonna lie, folks, here, I'm gonna be 100% honest. I'm very new, obviously, to doing these kind of videos. So, I'm not gonna add the coordinates to anything that I find, you know, sunken ships, ocean monuments, enderpearl, all that kind of good stuff, because I'm not gonna do it for this episode. If you guys want me to try and do that, I'll try and do it in the future. We'll try and integrate what we do on the legacy version, kind of seed showcases, onto the bedrock versions. But uh, yeah, folks, without further ado, let me just show you guys this amazing map at number five. So, bada bing, bada boom. Look at that right there, folks. This map, if you ask me, is honestly gorgeous now listen it isn't the best i'm not gonna lie this is why for me it comes in at number five and why it isn't honestly at number four number three number two number one you guys get what i'm saying but this is still an amazingly gorgeous seed so you spawn on this tiny little island right here with some trees so it isn't exactly a really hardcore hardcore survival island for all you awesome hardcore enthusiasts but if you come down here in the i guess bonus chest you guys can see we spawn with some dark oak tree saplings at least enough for one dark oak tree and um, two pieces of cactus uh, an axe you know obviously a pickaxe a potato which is just gorgeous if you ask me and a few other bits and bobs which honestly guys if that tickles your fancy that tickles your fancy for me it isn't honestly the best thing ever but nonetheless it's not that bad now this map right here folks is um it's a little bit peculiar all right it does have a lot of small islands honestly nothing really too i guess um i guess op except from one island i'll show you guys in a minute which maybe you'd see the top left hand side of the map let's just kind of keep that between us though for now now these maps are all relatively small but they are honestly all bearing and resources now if you guys are looking if you guys are starting up this map and you're looking to get some resources this will be incredible for you because at least you'll have enough i guess islands to choose from and um, you don't have to kind of be suffocated on one island you can kind of move around you can go into different places you can do a lot of different things and honestly guys it's quite refreshing to have that option which if you ask me is awesome now i'm gonna say this as well guys um excuse me that these seeds right here folks although they are really good now the only kind of issue is of course with the bedrock edition in my opinion is the fact being that there is no I guess world size you know you either get flat you get infinite or you get old if you guys don't know old isn't like classic size or anything like that old literally refers to a map that's like 200 by 200 rather than the classic size which is 500 by 500 and um, if you're wondering this map that I've got in my hand right now this map here actually is a 500 by 500 map so this whole you know map that you see right now this is the average kind of classic size world that's why i've got the map out so you guys can see the kind of i guess beginning of this map now the only issue is with that kind of folks because the map is infinite there is you know infinite amount of resources infinite amount of you know sunken ships ocean monuments etc etc literally the numbers go on and on and on so for me to add all the coordinates to these things down below is incredibly difficult which is why i'm not doing so but if you guys can think of some sort of cool compromise or a way i can do it then hit me up and let me know because i would be genuinely very interested guys now i'm taking you up here because this is the one i really want to show now this isn't exactly much of a survival island because it is quite large and honestly it's really connected as you can see over there to the i guess main island i guess the mainland if you want to call it that 
but this is still a great little island if you want to build a base. Now, if you guys are playing on this map with friends, which 100% I recommend you do, then you can come over here. You have the village kind of all to yourself. You can build a wall around this map, or I guess around this island, and at least you'd have plenty of space people to build it and expand and actually build a town or some sort of like area, I guess, some sort of fishing village if you want to call it that as well. You know, the, the, I guess like the biggest problem with a lot of the maps that I showcase or a lot of the islands that I showcase is there's not enough room to build. You know, you get like about 10 by 10 radius, and honestly, all you can really build is a farm in your house, and after that, you're kind of bored and really stuck, you know, kind of stuck and bored on the world. But with these kind of maps, as long as they're bigger and larger islands with still the island aspect to them, you can at least do a lot of awesome things, which is obviously the main point. But uh, yeah, folks, that's pretty much it for this kind of, I guess, this kind of seed right here, guys. Let's keep making our way now to the number four spot because, uh, or are making our way right now down to number five to the number four spot. And uh, yeah, keep making our way forward, guys, because there's a lot more awesome seeds that I really want to show All you right, guys. guys. So coming down at the number four spot, we have got this beautiful and amazing seed right here you guys can see it right there it is honestly a good looking little seed now listen before you guys go saying anything at all i know this is pretty much a jungle seed there is nothing else to say about it this seed is literally just littered and i mean honestly someone has just flung jungle tree saplings out the window this seed is just drowned in jungle tree saplings and jungle trees in general right um, and i dare honestly if the bonus chest has a single if it has a single jungle tree in it i will flip i'm not even kidding i will do a backflip right here right now but nonetheless folks for real this is an amazing seed right here now this and this isn't exactly much of a survival island seed however it still technically falls under the i guess abbreviation of a survival island uh, due to actually having a large body of water covering a piece of land and making it separate so it's the survival island if you don't know basically so yeah if you guys want to look right here this is where we spawn obviously we got the bonus the bonus chest luckily i honestly thought i just seen a jungle tree sapling there i was gonna say yo we're gonna have to get up and start doing some flips and um, honestly folks i'm not gonna lie man this isn't the worst seed i've ever seen i've definitely seen worse but this isn't the best seed guys and um, i think where you spawn off is a beautiful area on like honestly to me it's like a tropical paradise i don't know if it's just me but i can imagine drinking some i don't know I, I was going to say some cranberry juice. I don't know. I don't know why cranberry came to mind. I feel like a Ribena. I can imagine me just sitting here drinking a Ribena or better yet, even an Oasis. If you guys don't know what it is, it's a drink in the UK. You search it up. It's a good drink. But I can honestly just imagine myself drinking a nice Oasis, a nice cool cup of an Oasis, even though it doesn't come in a cup. Stop stop oversimplifying. And I just, just sitting here on the edge of the island, just, you know, enjoying the sun and getting all the rays and uh, all that kind of good stuff, guys. So yeah, for real, when you actually spawn in, guys, this island right here, or I guess this map or this, you know, whatever you want to call it, really is huge and littered with just really a lot of like many islands i guess you could call them um of just jungle tree areas or like jungle biomes i guess now i'm not gonna lie guys this island or this map could be a lot better that's why it comes at number four for me um the seed as well by the way guys i'm gonna give you a bit of a heads up right now because i noticed this while i was trying to get all the seed and stuff set up that is if you're using this seed on xbox make sure it's an all lower case for the seed um ap i think it's like apgiox that's the seed it'll be down below in the description like all the seeds but if you're using this on pocket edition or on uh you know windows 10 or i think nintendo switch i'm pretty sure bedrock's on then make sure you put it in all capitals or the first capital for the first beginning of the word apparently there's a difference and it does actually cause a little bit of a difference with worlds um i noticed it myself so just quick heads up to all you awesome people but uh, yeah guys that is the seed right here so there's not really a lot to it guys there's some bits and bobs here and there it's not that bad but it honestly folks isn't that good and for me i wouldn't exactly call this the best of my violence seed but again it isn't the worst guys so yeah let's continue making our way though nonetheless forward and let's continue going on guys to the number three spot and then down to the number two and then finally to the number one spot i know you're waiting for it all right, guys, so coming in at seed number three, we've got a real genuine survival island. Now, listen, this is a proper survival island, so I'm sure you guys are going to enjoy this seed. So, yeah, without further ado, bada bing, bada boom. Look at this seed right here, folks. It does look gorgeous. And honestly, I can say that with complete offer, like complete offer, uh, complete and utter confidence, guys. This seed is genuinely just gorgeous. Now, when you spawn in, I'm not going to lie, folks, I'm going to be 100% honest, it looks kind of bland, honestly. If you don't have the bonus chest on as well, you're going to have literally really nothing because uh, that big apple tree there i actually spawned in on purpose this was just for the thumbnail i was going to try and get this but uh yeah it, it didn't really work guys you know what i mean it just didn't it didn't work at all for some reason so yeah this tree actually isn't here on the seed and the seed will be uh, you know as always down below in the description but you guys can see on the map right now this is honestly mental this seed is just honestly a complete not just survival island seed it has no trees that spawn again forgetting that whole apple tree being there because that's not supposed to be there and you can see over here just across from us yes there is a tree on this island over here but that is the only trees nearby now it is an amazing seed when you spawn in because the oceans aren't that deep to the point where you can't actually go swimming or build underground bases and the islands that are nearby as well are really quite awesome and quite cool to adventure on and if you guys look over here you guys can see right there there's a bit of a larger island area which is kind of kind of sucky let's be honest nobody really likes a larger island 
islands we don't look for them when we look for survival islands do we but when you come over here you guys can see there is some more smaller kind of islands and if you want to do a factions map throughout this entire seed showcase i'd probably have to say this is a seed for you because guys this one sold it for me this one when I seen this, it just sold the entire thing for me. I love the look of the seed. I love how it kind of performs. I love the fact being that there's actually quite a few islands as well. I've got a lot to choose from. And I just love the vast open waters, honestly. It's so nice to see this, man. It really is an awesome view. And uh, yeah, guys, it is a great seed nonetheless. So again, this seed will be down below in the description, folks. And this is the seed that comes at number three. Let's keep an eye. Let's keep this keeper. I can barely speak. Let's keep making our way right now to the number two spot. And then finally, folks, onto that spicy number one spot. I know you're all waiting for it. And uh, yeah, guys, let's do it. All right, that. guys. So coming in at the number two spot, we have got another amazing seed right here. Now this one, guys is really weirdly called quick quit which i really don't know why and um, you're about to see right now and i'm not gonna lie this one is the one that i despise man it's the one that i honestly do hate i must admit that right here so without further ado let's have a look at this thing right now look at the seed right here guys now if you don't know already why i dislike this seed then uh, clearly you're quite new to the channel let me just briefly explain i hate and i i must put emphasis on this i literally hate honestly and utterly hate ice spike biomes i just despise the things i think they're just a waste of the ocean and they don't need to be in minecraft why is this in minecraft i don't understand but nonetheless this is this uh, i guess this i guess island right here this is a seed showcase so you guys uh, in the bonus chest you guys can see there are some things some little bits and bobs as i'd say there is another potato which is just thank the lords another potato who doesn't want a potato and two apples which again not too bad within uh, that another potato as well which is pretty awesome and uh, yeah let's just take a little bit of a look around the map so where you actually spawn is a pretty good little location i'm not gonna lie folks and um, it actually works really nice as well because you're right honestly on the very brink of the ice spike biome which for most of you guys if you do genuinely enjoy ice spike biomes you will enjoy this seed because this seed right here folks as i said is littered with it and um, my good friend septic spud who once again i'm getting these seeds from and big thank you to him big shout out to him and um, he actually at least on his version of his video at least on this one was which was on windows 10 and um, on his version it was a massive full map full of ice spike biomes uh, an entire basically ice spike um, what would be the name of this an iceberg even there was a massive iceberg pretty much map that was the entire survival island seed which was kind of weird for this one it's a little bit more toned down which in my opinion i like more honestly folks you can see right here we've got a bunch of little islands kind of all connected to the ice spike biome and they're all quite intertwined i guess they're all really quite i guess uh, tangled up within the same biome which is kind of weird if you ask me but it still is a really nice and honestly good looking map in its own now if we make our way up here you guys can see there is again some more islands there's also a ocean monument stuck underneath the ice somewhere here i don't know exactly i don't exactly know where it is um however i know it's here nonetheless that's all i can really say i know it's here and um, if we make our way this way though you guys can see there is a bunch more open water and along with that some more islands which is obviously fantastic again if you're looking for probably the most i guess island based seed with i guess the i guess like the most amount of water this probably is the seed for you because if you do exclude the ice spike biome as a biome because it really it is a biome but it isn't really it's just more of an attachment or an extra additional part of the water then it really is a whole water world pretty much with yeah again the exception of a few islands but this island over here folks is mad look at this so this is one i kind of liked about this map and it really did kind of catch my i guess uh, my eye you can see right here this place is honestly just amazing this whole island looks amazing from under the water and from above everything it actually looks fantastic and a massive coral reef uh, coral reef as well right beside it which is awesome so you guys this seed had to come at number two for that reason folks it is a good looking beautiful little seed and um, i think it could be better like most of them but again it's not too bad guys i'm not gonna lie i would have loved to have seen a village on this island i think there's definitely potential for it but hey ho guys there isn't so yeah let's keep making our way right now guys onwards and upwards and let's get right now to the number one spot that i know you guys have all been patiently waiting all right guys so coming in at seed number one the one that you guys have all been waiting for this is going to honestly be well worth your i have saved the best until last now listen i'm gonna say this right here and you can see my face for the first ever time if you have skipped to the very end without watching the entire video just by using the timestamps my man you are a traitor you need to re-watch the entire video like the like button twice which means in fact three times which means like it unlike it then re-like it there you go and then once you've done that you can watch the seed all right but uh, yeah guys without further ado even let's just jump right in and show you guys the seed right here so you guys can see right now this is honestly in my opinion gorgeous this is the best in my opinion that i've saved till last now listen guys i'm not gonna lie right this seed right here is just weird it's pretty cool it's pretty awesome but the seed itself guys is uh, i guess pretty xbox exclusive you could call it the seed itself is literally just called xbox and um i know for some that's gonna be like okay that's kind of strange joe and i agree <laughs> it is quite strange but honestly it is well worth using this seed now this seed you can see right here has got honestly 
I, I don't even know what to say, a multitude of islands. It has got at least over 20 islands I could count if you include the big islands on the top right and the bottom right hand side, which in my opinion I do. And um, guys, it is just a crazy awesome seed. Now, I'm going to say this once more guys at the end of the video because I feel like some might have missed it if they're like jumping along the video, which I know a lot of you guys do and honestly I don't really mind. As long as you, you know, nonetheless watch a video and enjoy it, that's really all that matters. But I know that some of you guys may have not already heard me say this, but I'll have it in the description as well, probably in the pinned comment that with some of these seeds they can have they some of them have to be in all capitals some of them have to be in all lowercase some of them only have to have a capital there at the beginning it's very strange how these seeds work and it looks like that these seeds actually change on the edition of minecraft that you're playing on and um, for instance if you're playing on minecraft xbox one bedrock edition the seed might be xbox in all lowercase however if you're playing on windows 10 edition on bedrock or pocket edition or you know you know i think it's what nintendo switch then it might be all capitals you never really know guys it does kind of vary and it does change um but yeah i just thought i mentioned that point one more time guys but you can see right here i mean this seed right here folks is honestly quite nice it is incredibly weird looking but it is honestly really 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 cool and if you guys are looking for an awesome survival island adventure on bedrock edition i 100 percent recommend checking out the seed right here guys because it is honestly so cool and it honestly has got a lot of potential as well if you ask me guys you could do a lot of things on this map and um, have an actual factions map like i've said with the other ones or if you want to get a little bit more creative and a little bit more crazy you could try doing something like building a town on every single island and from there having like little areas like trading towns you know fishing towns shopping sounds I, I feel like i'm saying the word towns too much but you guys know what i'm saying you catch my drift and you guys are smart enough to understand so yeah folks but anyway guys i'm gonna end the video there and as always i want to just say before i end the video thank you so 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 much for watching today's video i really do hope you guys go to enjoy and have went to enjoy even and um, if you have be sure to drop a like down below and of course a comment let me know what you thought of the video and if you can do be sure to subscribe we are making our way to 16,000 subscribers right now which is just awesome and if you guys can as well share the video with your friends and family it helps the video and the channel get a lot more further out there so honestly it would be very 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 appreciated and once again guys before i end the video i want to say right now right here that i want to hear your opinions on the whole face cam on the top left of the screen uh, if you've been watching the entire time you maybe just didn't notice i'm here this is me um i want to know if you guys like this or if you prefer the old style and uh, what i could do to maybe improve these seed showcases for the bedrock edition and all the other kind of good stuff guys and yeah folks i uh, thank you for watching today's video i'll see you guys on the next one have a wonderful day or a wonderful night wherever you are and you yeah, guys Peace out. So before the video ends, let me just plug my little members, only kind of little plug in right here. All these amazing people right here, these guys are all beautiful and amazing members. If you want to get your hand on becoming a member, click that join button down below. It would be incredibly appreciated. Not just that as well, you'll receive moderate on the channel for life and a free invite to any of our streams, a one-time only free invite, however, a private role in our members only Discord, plus nostalgic videos every single week in the channel. And of course, last but not least, the most fantastic thing by itself, a special thank you at the very end of all our videos, like these amazing people right here. That's pretty good.